Board Game Fantasy videos, and we're back in the direction today, and I thought it'd be amazing to bring you guys The Kid and the Camera, a short horror film. Now, a lot of y'all have been asking me to react to a lot of analog horror, and I'm down with it. I'm not scared. You know me. You know me, your glorious captain. You know the general, the five-star salute, man. I ain't scared of no horror, bro. So we about to get into it. I'm not going to waste too much time. The Kid and the Camera by Grumbled Inc. Entertainment. Without a further ado, <laughs> let's give it a view. Special announcement at the end of the video for a few different things, so stick around. All right, I'm into it. TVY, Tiny Toe, Star O'Clock Stories, created by Kid The Kid in the Camera. Lock in, chat. This is about to be a good one. Once upon a star, there lived a boy named Kalen. Okay. He was a happy little tot of six years old. And on his birthday, he received a very special gift. His very own photo camera. Oh, they gave him a camera. It's a big watch. Kalen loved the camera. So much that he took it out every day, snapping photos of anything he could. Okay. A picture here, a picture there. Until one day, a terrible accident happened. Alright, lock in, chat. It's about to get crazy. Oh, his camera's gonna break! Damn. And the camera broke. Sounds like you gotta get that fixed, buddy. Kalen didn't sleep a wink. Haunted by thoughts of his once perfect camera late into the night. Hmm. That was when a sudden sound caught his attention. Hmm. What is it? On the window? Whoa, okay, whoa, how did the cam- How did the camera get back? So, he broke his camera, heard a knock on his window, and somehow the camera came back? What? What happened? His parents buy him another one? That's not his parents game. Yeah, he's about to be kidnapped. Ah, you know what, it's fine. And there stood on the other side of Kalen's bedroom window. A large winged creature. What the fuck is that? Hello there, young lad. Greeted the creature. I'm the Kipsneed. You're the Kipsneed? What the fuck is a Kipsneed? Bro, okay, look. I don't watch a whole lot of analog horror, so I don't really know what the fuck's going on right now, but what the fuck is that dinosaur butterfly amalgamation? It looks like he's a Pokemon. Okay, well, looks like he fed. belongs a Pokemon. Greeted the creature. I'm the Kipsneed. Your sleep fairy. Sleep fairy? Hmm. That is correct, replied the Kipsneed. Hmm. My job is to make sure you get a good night's sleep, but it's come to my attention that you haven't been resting at all lately. I'd like to know the reason why. He's a psycho serial killer murderer demon god sent from Algaroth. There's no way, because think about it, bro, think about it. You want him to have a good night's sleep, yet you're knocking on this JIT's window at 3 a.m.? And you just gave him a new camera? No, you're a psychopathic killer. I'm not falling for it. We're not falling for Kalen it. had never heard of a sleep fairy. My parents told me not to talk to strangers. Strangers? I'm no stranger. I know all the girls and boys around the globe. I know what? their parents, their homes, their names. Why? I even know your name, Kayla. Cause now, that would a stranger know your name? Do you see this? Do you see this? Is that my horse? Bro, look, okay, look. This is why y'all can't trust shit, bro. If you are under the age of fucking, I don't even know, 13, my nigga, don't trust no stranger. He's a stranger. He knows your name. He knows kids' names. He even knows the parents. That He's a fucking psychopathic god killer. I don't give a fuck. The eyeballs are crazy. Though. on it for a moment. No, I guess not. If you must know why I'm awake, it's my camera. Hmm. It's broken. Oh. And just like that, tears welled up in Kalen's eyes. Let me see. Oh. Oh, I thought he gave him a new camera. Oh, so the camera's still broken. It's the same one. Then okay. the Kipsneed had an idea. Is that? Why don't I get this camera fixed for you? Perhaps that would help you sleep easier. You could do that. Is that his antennas? Of course, and I know just the place. 
a factory in my homeworld. Oh, yeah. I'll lead you to the portal. Homeworld? Just follow my voice. And the kips need disappeared into the night. Homeworld portal? What the fuck is this? This way. Kaelin followed close behind the kips need. Kaelin, don't go, bro. Kaelin, don't go. Snapping photos to mark the way in case of getting lost. You already know this is about to get devious. Now, these pictures may look kind of normal right now. They're about to get insane. We already know. Look how creepy it looks already. He's going to die. Okay. I'm s- Kaylin, don't- Oh! AG40. At last. Kaylin reached a house. Don't be this guy. All right, we're getting, don't don't be Kaylin, bro. He's he's a dumb horror protagonist. I mean, he's a kid. I can't. But what the fuck is that? He lives in a cabin in the Seems woods. Quite abandoned. Thought the boy. Killed the boy. And dark. But there was the Kips Needs voice again, beckoning. The portal to my home world's inside. Come along. It's a portal to hell because he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna TOS the child. He's gonna absolutely <laughs> rip and tear the child. Okay, look, I, that's my guess. Let me know in the comments what you think. He's gonna it's a portal. It's a portal straight down below. He's gonna be looking up at us with a frown. I'm I'm sorry. It's it's gonna it's gonna happen. I must have my camera fixed. So, in spite of his obvious fright. Kalen marched into the home. Mm -hmm. Okay. He's never seen again. His parents are worried about him. Oh, these are the pictures. Is that Harry Potter's basement? Like, from the... What the fuck? Kalen, you're done, bruh. You're done. R.I.P. Kalen, bruh. R.I.P. Kalen in the chat, bro. is that is that the thing the kips need wow this is a creepy fucking cabin Kaylin just leave bruh why are you still there Dang it, I thought I was gonna get a countdown. I thought I was gonna hit it. To a jump scare. <laughs> I was fucking wrong. God damn. Okay, Caitlin. Just get out of it. Now, was I right? Or was I wrong? That's not a fucking kiss me, Kaylin! That's a fucking serial killer named Joseph, probably! Like, sorry to all the, Jos uh, the Josephs out there, but like, bro! Chair? What are we doing here? Chair? Chair? Okay, bro, this is craziness. Like, bro, look. That's a Joseph if I've ever seen one, bro. Kips need. The fuck you talking about, Kips need? Look, Kaylin should have never went. He heard a knock on his window. He got fucking kidnapped by the Some ghost of Christmas Pat. Authorities discovered the basement. The rest of the boy was never found. We gotta talk. What the fuck happened to Kaylin? Okay. You guys are the best community on the planet, and you always educate me on what the fuck happens in these videos, okay? Because I'm dumb. I don't know what the fuck happened to Kaylin. He died! That's, I mean, I, that's all I surmised! But, like, the fuck happened to his body, and why leave the feet? Kip Sneed. What, does that have anything to do with the, what does that mean? Why would he leave the feet? That just raises more questions! I'm, like, I'm more confused why he would leave the feet in the nasty-ass socks and take the rest of the boy. Like, what the fuck are we talking about? 
Written and directed and animated, scored and edited by Brayden Ortiz, written and by Richard Stibbard. Hey, shout out to them. This was, I mean, I gotta say, this was a very intriguing video. It was very interesting, very well, uh, what is it called? Like VHS, like it's very well created. I don't know, the filter is cool. I like the, uh, the analog horror feel to it. I like the horror element to it. And I like the fact that it's a simple story that could happen. Like there, obviously there's no fucking God Kips need thing, but serial killers can lie, but you know, get kids to go where they need to go and it's sad that that happens but um yeah it's it's a really good video 28 dude they only have 28k subs dude please subscribe to them their links are in the description please give them a like and a sub 28k do they deserve a million they deserve two million bro how many of these do they make that is crazy anyway i love this video salute to you guys bro that that was that was a great video let me know what you think in the comments of that down below please and also uh the reaction's over so if you only came to watch the reaction of the video <laughs> sayonara i appreciate you for watching salute to the organ you know what i'm saying but for the real ones that stay you know that we gotta have a little talk i'm curious what do you think that my hair should be bro because I, I don't know what to do with this like look at this this is this is not it bro this is fucking this is terrible so look i'm trying to get my hair twisted next month should I get box braids or should I get dreads? Like high top dreads. Just let me know. Uh, <laughs> shit. I would even look up like chat GPT and tell it to like make uh, pictures of me with those hairstyles. Look which one is better. But if there's any artists out there, bro, what would I look like with them? I really don't know. I've never had my hair twisted. I'm, I'm, I'm very genuinely curious which one I should do and which one y'all would rather like would look cooler on me. I don't know. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. But please go support them. Please go, you know, give them their, uh, their just dues, their flowers. You know what I'm saying? Tell them Oregon Gang sent you. And other than that, yeah, I don't have too much else to say about this video because I genuinely don't know what happened. I know that he died. I don't know where his fucking... He got Mortal Kombat fatality. That, I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Apparently, y'all keep calling me the new fucking Corey Kenshin, so I guess I'm the new Corey Kenshin. I, I guess, bro. Corey, come back so they stop calling me the new Corey, bro. Please! Anyway, I love y'all. Salute to the Oregon man. I'm going to go ahead and skedaddle. And as always, raise up your hand and so.